You hear that? That's the awkward silence of a family dinner after you just got caught vaping. Most vapes contain high levels of nicotine and disappointment. <sighs> Brought to you by The Real Cost and the FDA. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to another extra of the T Moss Boss Show. And in today's episode, or extra, my fault. Hold on. Let me let me do that again. All right, what's up, guys? Welcome to another extra of the Team Ozboss Show. And in today's extra... Okay, there we go. Sounds a lot better. But anyways, jokes aside, um, yeah, I, I've said it times before, and I'm going to say it again. I am officially done with Activision. I'm officially done with Call of Duty. It's, you know, the thing is, is that I saw so the other day... I decided I was going to give Modern Warfare 2 another chance. I tried another fix. It didn't work. I do not believe that it is my PC. Because it worked before on my PC, right? Now, I'm confused by it. Because I added new parts, better parts, to my PC to overall have it where, you know, I have more memory. I can play games better, all that. Processor, hard drive, solid state drive, graphics card. I've done all these different upgrades. And you mean to tell me that doing upgrades is going to prevent me from playing the game? What's crazy is that I can play any other Call of Duty title, right? I can play any other Activision title. Just in case if there are any other Activision games out there, I can play those. I can play just about every video game that is available on PC, except Call of Duty Modern Warfare 2. I'm pretty sure I can go and download a game that's not even in development anymore, they ain't even got no updates coming out for it anymore, and I'll still be able to play that. In fact, I have. I downloaded the, not the remastered, but the old Grand Theft Auto uh, games that came out. The Grand Theft Auto Trilogy series, San Andreas 3, Vice Cities. I played those. No problem. What's up with Modern Warfare 2? So that's, I don't even want people to answer that question. I don't even want people to try to come after me all like, oh, where's that? I'm not hearing nothing anybody has to say from this day forward, all right? Actually, you know what? No, from days weeks months ago okay when i start even having this issue in the first place i made it clear okay i'm not gonna play any call of duty title from here on out that goes for old titles that goes for new titles current titles whichever i don't care if they decide oh well let's you know uh this, you add, add t moss boss to the next one let's try to accommodate let's try to do everything to like make this guy feel better there's absolutely nothing that you can do unless they give me my money back but i highly doubt that that's gonna happen so therefore I have no desires on supporting that company and that video game franchise anymore. From this day forward, you will never, ever in life see me play another Call of Duty title again. Ever. That's like that. No, I, I'm just sick and tired of companies where they come out with games and then the games don't work properly. And it's like, OK, well, how do you expect um, your fans to continue? And it, like I said before eventually is going to get to the point in time where they make the wrong people upset and they're going to have to answer for this stuff. And I truly do believe it, that it's either going to be them getting shut down because they keep putting on crappy game after crappy game after crappy game, or there's going to be a company out there that actually listens to their fans, that actually fixes their video games. And then you know what? It's just going to run Call of Duty out of business. And there's going to be absolutely nothing that they can do about it. Who knows? Maybe it might be me. It might be somebody else. But I guarantee and I promise you, there is going to be a game out there that just cancels out Call of Duty. Or Call Activision is going to make the wrong somebody upset. And they ain't going to have no choice but to close their doors. All right? So... Anyways, and I, I cannot wait for that day, all right? So I might be an old man when that day happens, but I, I cannot wait 
for that day, all right? So anyways, and that being said, I will talk to y'all later. Thank you guys for uh, watching and or listening. Stay tuned for the next extra, and peace.